Maeve, are you okay? Um, no, I feel sick. That was such a close call. He's okay. Billy's gonna be fine. Nick's in there smothering him with cuddles. Yeah, he's really brave. I just, I, I don't understand how Cassie would do that. You know, he could have... Stealing is insulin. She's an addict. You don't think she'll actually shoot up, do you? Oh, I don't know. I don't know if she even knows what it is. I, I don't know anything. Could kill her. I have called the police. They are looking for her. He's dozing. I just have to pee. I'm so sorry, Nick. I just don't understand how she could do that after everything we've done for She's her. She's been through a massive yeah, trauma. and she doesn't care about anyone but herself. Not Billy. Not her baby. She's just a kid. Discharge then? Yep, yeah, they're just finishing up with him now. You can go on in a sec. No, I've got to get to it, but can you please give him this for me? Oh. He's been so brave. Oh. That is so nice of you. <laughs> Any word from Cassie? I hope she's okay. Well, she knows how to look out for number one. Maeve. Yeah, I know, it's serious. Well, you're with the responders today, so you can keep an eye out for it. Well, if anyone has had an insulin overdose. Look, they get lots of calls to the park and places where kids live rough. Great. She needs help, babe. We've tried. Nick, she's not interested. Well, I know that you're not going to wash your hands of her. I can't make her accept help. But there's a tiny baby out there. Babe. No, it's okay. I'm, I'm okay. Thank you all for being here. Um, I've been in many extensive talks with Esther. Yes. Selena. Says I'm just trying to support you. We know how disruptive a strike can be. It goes against why we became nurses in the first place, to help people. We're not helping anyone by being overworked and underpaid. Absolutely. And believe me, Esther knows our worth. She knows we deserve more. So what's the offer? 1.5 now and another 1.5 in a year's time. What the hell? You're joking. We wanted more, I know, but it's genuinely all Esther has. If she could give us more, she would. Sounds like someone's drunk the Kool-Aid. Hmm, or trying to buy a house. That's irrelevant. Okay, great. Good for you, Madonna. But is that tiny bump really gonna help? This has nothing to do with our house, I promise. Sure it doesn't. We haven't fought this hard for scraps, okay? We deserve more, so let's make sure we get it. Okay, before we get the pitchforks out, let's just calm the farm. Okay, I don't like that stink offer any more than you guys. But Madonna's put her booty on the line for us, okay? Without her, we'd still be little doormats, letting all the doctors wipe their shoes all over us. Yeah, yeah, the offer's crap. But if anyone can get us more moolah, it's her, okay? So let's just show a little bit more faith and let's give Madonna another shot. You mean go back to Esther? Oh yeah, really sock it to her this time. Okay, fine, but it's got to be more. A lot more, or we walk. You won't regret it. Selena. Oh, sis, you got this, okay? Just give Esther one of those scary faces that you give Junior when he leaves the toilet seat up. You're going to smash it. She's got it wrong. Say it. Hey, I got you, okay? Okay, we're here to help. Can you hear me? Pulse is normal. Breathing's stable. Hey, can you hear me? Hey! Come on! Hey! 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 Where's the stuff? I don't have any drugs, okay? You're right. No drugs. Okay, not the ones you want anyways. Well, you want some ibuprofen? Some paracetamol? Won't have any of the rest, all right? Whatever. Kara, right? You're not smart, you know. Oh, you want the cops down here? We'll be long gone. Where did you get that? Eh? The skateboard, where did you get it? Can you give it to me? As if. Please. I think it's my son's. Your Wilder's mum? Who are you? Hey. No, who are you? Where did you get it? Then Cassie, give it to you. Tell me where you got it. Hey, Let me go. Wilder's Cassie stolen from us. Hey, come on. 
Hey, let's just get out of here. You know, I thought it was a skateboard, and yep, it's gone. She knew who I was. Did you know her? No, I've never seen her before. Never heard Wilder or Cassie mention the car, right? but... I mean, I guess she must be a friend of Cassie's. Well, maybe she knows where she is. We can we can talk to her. She didn't strike me as a talkative type. We have to try. How's the little guy? He's, he's fine. Let's play with that new car that you got. Good. <laughs> have you heard any word about... Are the police even looking? I'm sure that they're doing their best. Their best. There might be a baby alone out there, Nick. Cassie might be alone. When she should be here with us. When her baby should yeah, be... Yeah, I know. Babe, I know. What if she's taking that insulin, Nick? What, I loved her. He would want me to protect her, but I was just so angry. We will keep looking tomorrow, OK? We will find this car girl. She might know. So we've just checked the area again. Uh, a lot of kids clearly living rough, but none of them would speak to us. No, yeah, no, no, I am giving you an update, and then you can give me your update. Maeve. Look, I'm sorry, Detective, OK? I'm just... I'm just losing my mind here. OK, great, thank you. There is zero sense of urgency. They've got a big team on it. Yes, they say that, but in reality, did we see a single police car anywhere near there? No, we did not, Nick. So it is left to us. Look, if Cassie wants to be found, they will find her. You can't know that. We did everything we could, and she still chose to leave. And it's brutal. And it'll break you if you let it. OK, what about the baby? The baby didn't choose can, any can of you this. you do me a favour? You just breathe, OK? <sighs> breathe. Look, if something terrible happens, I just need to know that I never stopped looking for that baby. And I will help you, OK? We will look tomorrow. But that's it for tonight, OK? I'm going to make us some food and I, I won't go to the meeting. No, Nick, you should go, OK? We'll grab a quick bite, but then I think I'm just going to... I'm going to do one more drive around. Maeve. Boo! 2.5% is a great offer. Boo! Selena. It's insulting. Strike, strike, strike. You're not even a nurse, Logan. Bro, be quiet before they start chucking stuff at us. Well, solidarity, man. Enter at your own risk. Isn't that bad? Well, Donna needs backup. They're already getting up to it. Well, I have to stay neutral. Nick, 2.5. What do you say? Uh, well, um, it is all of your decision, but um, I will support you. Dr. Samuel's offer is full and final. We need to settle on 2.5. There's no more money. She said that last time. Okay, go for the throat, Madonna. Don't wuss out. Five percent. Stop stirring everyone up, Selena. Well, someone has to. Five, five, five for five. Thanks, Logan. Support noted. We can't put patients' lives at risk again. We need stability now. So please accept the offer. I'm begging you. No more strikes. This will ruin everything. Billy, what do you say? I think everyone should go with their own conscience. Yeah, OK, Switzerland. Please spread the word. We vote tomorrow. You know my vote already. N-O. No. What was that? You know how I feel about this. Backing up your fiancé doesn't feel right. It's not a great offer. If they don't accept this, everything changes, Vili. Everything. as soon as I can. Done that yet? No, I would do it myself. Hey, hey, how's the revolution going? What? You guys are voting again, aren't you? Oh, I don't care what I get paid. I just want to know where that baby is. Yeah, poor kid. We keep hounding the police, but they don't have enough staff. Well, mate, what can I do? Um, just keep your eyes open wherever you are. Yeah, sure. Maeve, I asked you to cover an ED. Yeah, OK. No, they're not. Well, I need to make calls. What calls? Um, to other hospitals, to the... Well, mate, I can do that. Hold my hand. Of course. No, look, just, I'm sorry, but I have to shut this down. What? This is work time. Just go, Logan. Thank you for the support. Not. My heart is breaking for that baby. But we are not responsible, OK? We're understaffed and we need to work, so just go get changed and then recess, please. Papa? 
The team of the NFL is waiting for you. Watch that leg. Thanks, man. No problem. Hey, Nick, what's the latest with the nurses? It sounds like they agreed to 2.5. Okay. Wow. Hey, I'm sorry I was so hard on you before. Oh, it's okay. Hey? The senior nurses were just taking a while to come back from all the I said it's so. okay. But I've got enough cover now, so you can go home and rest. Yeah, I'd rather be working. Logan's waiting for me. But you didn't sleep last night. Maybe you should talk to someone. I'm talking to you. Well, you're not going to like what I have to say. Okay, we have to say it now. The baby could be dead and not reported to a hospital mortuary. You think I haven't considered that? What, you want me just to give up? Just leave it to the police. Okay, and we look after ourselves. Sleep, eat properly. And if you need some time off, I can make that happen. I don't want time off. You'll be okay? Yeah. And there will be a point when we have to let Cassie's baby go. Wilder's baby. I'm just thinking of your sanity, that's all. Okay, fine. I will look after myself. I promise. They say trunk when the bonnet is a hood and we say boot. What? Oh, hold the line. Call out. Oh, it's just some drunk I got stuck on one of those billboards on the motorway. What, is he injured? Are we on? Nah, he's all right. He's just wasted. They'll just chuck him in the slammer. Hey, mate, can you just take that? Are you sure you're okay to work? Yeah. What else am I gonna do? Look, I don't care what Nick says. If you want to keep looking for that baby, I'm in. I have to accept that he's probably dead. We'd know by now if he turned up anywhere. My bogan mates are pretty good detectives. I mean, they tracked down Dawn and Lulu. Yeah. Nick would hate that. She'll never know. No, no. I have to leave it to the police. I haven't gone crazy. I've been sending Nick crazy. Ah, uh, uh, the cops picked up Billboard Baggins. <laughs> oh, hold on. Unconscious person outside of Balneys Park. No reports of injuries. We should check that out. Yeah? Hmm, Pete's moping around here. Well, come on. You deserve a medal for getting rid of my headache. One of them, anyway. I can't really take the credit. Why not? I'm just relieved the whole thing's over. Well, I owe you one. Please don't say that. Oh, come on, you need to do something to celebrate. You should make some wedding plans you. or something. Oh, what's up, Linga? Does Nicole know? Know what? About Madonna's special pay rise and bonus and new job. Yeah, someone leaked it all. All your juicy, disgusting details. What is this new job? <gasps> Nurse consultant. First I've heard. Madonna negotiated herself a big fat kickback and sold us out at the same time. Hmm? Billy, you got something to say? So you knew everything. I, uh, my own brother. You make me sick, man. Both of you do. Let's go. You walk around doing that, Virgin Mary Edwin, you are the worst of them all. You're a liar and a traitor. Okay, can we talk about this somewhere private? Too late. It's going public. What? You think I was going to keep it to myself? The nurses know. They do know. No, Selena! And here you are, buttering me up with all that bridesmaid stuff. It's game over, honey. And FYI, we strike tomorrow. Okay, wait. You sure this is the right spot? Yeah, south end. And my sense of direction is on point, okay? No need for a GPS. Yeah, well, they're long gone. Looks like a walk, they don't really need us. I suppose. Logan! Hey, can you see? Can you hear me? Be close, shallow breathing. Hey, I'm chilling. Okay, get the bag. Okay. Well, yeah, I can do it. Just get the bag. Okay. Cassie, honey, what else have you taken? Hypertensive, eighty over forty and dropping. Rest rate elevated at twenty-eight. Pulse one hundred and fifty. Blood sugar two point eight. Given IV dextrose en route. Ten. Thirty-nine point six. GCS to ten. Okay, on my count. One, two, three. Symptom shock. Has to be. We know she gave birth recently, right? Not exactly when. She's been using drugs for something, including insulin. She's diabetic? No, she's just um, shooting up whatever she can get her hands on, I think. So we're going to need a full tox screen fast. Full bloods and a cross match. Book an urgent CT and have a surgical reg on standby. OK. 
I say, you're in the hospital now, honey, okay? And we're gonna look after you. But a very high fever, all right, possible infection. And we're gonna treat that, get your temperature down, and then you're gonna be feeling a lot better, okay? Okay, see? Then we are gonna talk about everything. I am not mad, okay? I just wanna help you. Hey, Maeve. Yeah. Let's let them do their thing, eh? Come on. Come on. Mm. Oh, Joe's assessing her now. Hang on, here he comes. I'll, I'll call you back. Okay. Well? Walked in here for a laparotomy. That bad? Cassie has a very large uterine cyst, about sepsis and inflammation. It's lucky you found it when you did. Uh, when you operating now? Antibiotics overnight to get that fever under control and to get her stable after that cocktail of drugs. Surgery tomorrow. Okay. Just save her, Joe. Oh, God, she could have died out there. I'll do my best. And if she, um, anything she says under sedation or whatever, like if she remembers anything about the birth or, or her baby. Oh, listen out. Hey, you heard the man? Okay, it's all under control now. You can stand there. You saw her, Logan. She doesn't care if she lives or dies, and she does not care about her baby. <sighs> okay, work to rule. No admin paperwork, no elective surgery. Essential patient care only, okay? Understood. Yes, is on the ropes, and she can't afford bureau nurses like last week, so we fight. This could get ugly. No, oh, speaking of... Uh, Dr. McCaskill just booked Theatre 4 tomorrow morning for a laparotomy. It's Cassie. I'm afraid so. Well, at least it's not more urgent. Fingers crossed. You'll be crossing yourself tonight, all right? Because in the morning, we're back on strike. Which I'll be supporting. Yeah, right. Two-Face. I'll leave it out, Linga. What's done is done. Okay, while you are currently not striking, can everyone get back to work, please? Not you, Madonna. At least it's on the open now. <sighs> when were you going to tell me? I'm sorry, it was still at the offer stage. Attempting offer, obviously. Going behind the back of the D.O.N. The intention was never to undermine you. The intention was to bribe you out of striking. It was career advancement. Sure it was. An operation? Why? Sometimes with childbirth, um, a part of the placenta is left behind and it can cause infection. Cassie. Well, in your case, there's a, a cyst that needs to be surgically removed. It's causing you pain and a fever. Can't I just have drugs? You're on antibiotics and pain relief, but they can't do the whole job. Without the operation, honey, you could die, but we're not going to let that happen, okay? Look, I know it might not feel like it right now, Cassie, but your life can be good again, healed and happy. Maeve's right. Let us help you this time. Morning, guys. Cassie will be first up in the theatre four today. How are you feeling, Cassie? A bit sleepy. Yeah, she's had her pre-med. Okay. We've got your temperature under control, so we're very safe to proceed. The anaesthetist will look after you. Okay. Let's scrub in, shall we? Are you ready for this? Sure. I know the equipment, Drew's preferred layout, all the scrub nose moves. Be fine. How's Cassie? Joe's doing a laparotomy right now. <laughs> right. How's her state of mind? Um, she has gone from wasted and incoherent to less incoherent. Are the psych team on to it? That's our next stop, I hope. But God, Harper, the not knowing is driving me insane. About the birth? Do you think she literally can't tell you anything or she won't? Oh, I think she wants to block it out, definitely. But I mean, come on, some level. Yeah, she must remember something. Well, hang on there. <laughs> How's the ritual going? No, oh, nightmare. How are mm. things in ED? Same. My time's already doubled and they're only set to get worse. Yes. And I can feel the support of the doctors drying up just like that. <sighs> yeah. What do you think? No. Away. Hey. Uh, hey. Leave me. Cassie. No. Hey. It's Maeve. You're just coming out of your operation. Operation? Yeah, I explained it to you, remember? You're just waking up from your anaesthetic. You had a bad postpartum infection. 
to remove the cyst and managed to clean up most of the infection, so we should be fine in a little while, okay? Back to normal. How long do I have to stay here? Just a couple of days, just until the infection's all gone. And you got a couple of stitches in your abdomen as well, okay? That'll take a little while to heal. Um, you'll need to find a proper place to stay. Not sleeping rough. Won't be your place though, will it? How painful was it when you gave birth, do you remember? No. Some women wish they couldn't remember. Did it go on for very long, the labour? Stop it. Look, you understand that I loved Wilder so deeply. And I love his baby too. Which is why I need to know what's happened, even if it's bad. You see? Is the baby dead? You can tell me. I just, I need to know. Or does someone else have the baby? Are they looking after him until he can come back to family? I don't know. Just stop, okay? recovering from the laparotomy. I know, but it's urgent. Why? What scan? Oh, man. Did the scan go? I didn't see anything. Well, that's a relief. No, it was inconclusive, so... I'm, I'm sorry, but, yeah, we're going to have to take her back to surgery. What? No. It's, it's OK, Cassie. I will get you settled back in. Back in a sec, OK? Maeve? Maeve, we are really, really sorry. You should be. I can't believe how useless you two were. Hey, this is not just on us. Oh, yeah? How do you figure that? Cassie's the one who stole the insulin and took off. If she hadn't... No, Harry! Well, it's true. She wouldn't even be no, here. Don't, don't even bother finishing that thought. You were incompetent. You were negligent. And I'm going to make a formal complaint with Esther. Okay, that pain relief should kick in. Something's going on. Paranoia is everywhere, Jerome. I'm not getting sucked in again. Okay. Watch your back. Again, we are... So sorry, and of course we'll apologise to Cassie. Well, I hope it's better than the half-assed apology from Harry and Stella. Believe me, I've already given them a piece of my mind. They need more than a slap on the wrist. Harry was way out of line. He had to go. They're my team. I'll handle it. Okay, fine. I just don't want him around her. That won't be a problem. We'll be able to discharge Cassie shortly. She won't have to see Harry again. Good. Billy is ready to be picked up from his play date. Uh, I can go get him. You sure? Yeah. Can you check in on Cassie for me? Yeah, yeah. I'll pop in later. We are so sorry. I know. But maybe it's time to make an agreement with the nurses. Let me know if there's anything we can do to help with Cassie. Did it just get chilly in here? You didn't have to go there. Hey, I'm not getting caught in the middle. <laughs> it's not what I heard. I'm just a mentor, a guide. Think of me as the wise old guy with the long beard. Well, maybe you could mentor Harry out of Maeve's way. Never a good time to face the wrath of Maeve. What else she doing? She seems a little intense. She wants Cassie to live with us again. After what she did? She's not well, Joe. She's trouble. Tell me you said no. Pally got off pretty lightly. You might not be so lucky next time. Yeah, you don't think I've thought of that? Cassie needs help. And it needs to be far away from Pally. If it was up to me, Talia would never have been allowed around Marley. That, that is different. How? Because Maeve thinks she can save Cassie. 
turn her into some daughter substitute. True. Am I wrong? Well, Cassie is Maeve's last connection to Wilder, and I cannot take that away from her. Cassie, how are you feeling? Tired. Any soreness at all? Not much. Right. Oh, well, sounds like we've got your pain relief about right then. I need something stronger or I won't be able to sleep. I will get the doctor to review it. Now? As soon as I can. And Nicole? Yeah. Um, I know I haven't said it before, but I am sorry for stealing from you and Bella. Are you sure you don't want me to call your mum? She thinks I'm unholy. They all do. What about any other family, people who aren't in the church? There's no one else. Where's, where's Billy? Uh, he is with Mandy making a card for Cassie. Oh. He's so sweet. He's insisting on finishing it. <laughs> Can I see him? Oh, we, we need to let you rest. But I want to see him. I, I might have to get him home, but he could maybe bring the card in tomorrow. The level of detail he's gone into, it's going to take quite some time. Okay. Can you please tell him how sorry I am being such a pain for everyone? How I know I'm a mess. Well, why don't you write him a note? You know, just in case he can't come in tonight. Yeah, okay. Yeah? Do you want to give her your pen? <laughs> Thanks. We'll give you a minute. How's she been? Um, physically, she's okay. Emotionally. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm okay. She really cares about him, doesn't she? Okay. Okay, what? Okay, she can move back in with us. Are you serious? Do we just have to be prepared this time for withdrawals and what they can do? Yeah, we will be. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Oz are staying at a vineyard in Otago. Oh, lucky for some. I reckon. Meanwhile, we are on withdrawal duty. Wish Cassie wasn't so pissed off with us. Mm. She knows this is the right thing, babe. She knows we're just trying to help her. Talking about me? Yes, you are the hot ticket. <laughs> Breakfast? Mm. Sorry I threw up on you. Is the empty nausea helping? How are you feeling? Great. That's the spirit. Where's Billy? He's still sleeping. Good. Looks scary. You'll start feeling better soon. It's the worst over. First step's the hardest. Why do I feel like this? Look, honey, we know this is really tough. Right? Yeah, of course. But you just have to stay strong. No turning back. I can't do it. Yes, you can. You're not alone, honey. We are here. We have got you. Maeve. Hey. Oh, it's gonna get better, honey, I promise. Esther. Cassie is reading to be there. How cute is that? Oh, it's very sweet. <laughs> Do you remember when Wilder read to Bella? Bella were driving crazy, mm. asking questions and interrupting. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. It's just really nice having a full house again. I was thinking we should get professional help for Cassie. Counselling? Yeah. Okay, I'll set it up. A rehab centre. <laughs> Send her away? Last night was tough. On her and on us. Yeah, I can handle it, Nick. You don't have to. That is not what I'm saying. Then what are you saying? You want me to abandon her like everyone else in her life? No, I... Hey, you okay? Um, I need a lie down. Yeah, okay, I'll come and... That's okay. I can take care of myself. She won't know anyone. Yeah, well, that might be a good thing. No emotional baggage. <laughs> So wild is emotional baggage now. It is just complicated with you and Cassie. We're family, Nick. I want to help her. Mm. It's not like that. When she remembers, I want to be there for her. And if that leads to a baby, you can be one big happy family. Okay, well, you don't need to be cruel. Hey, I'm, not, I'm sorry, Maeve. I just, I can see you're getting your hopes up over something that might not even happen. You're trying to cut me off from my last link to Wilder. She's not him, babe. I'm just worried that you're gonna get hurt. Well, that's a risk I'm willing to take. It's my decision, Nick, okay? And if you don't like it... Hey, what's up? You're sure? Yeah, no, of course, of course, thank you. Um, 
that girl I was telling you about, the one who found Wilder's skateboard, um, she's in ED right now. Logan found her outside. You mean Kara? Yeah. Is she okay? Uh, I don't know. I'm going to go check on her. I'm coming. Uh, no, you're not. She's my friend. I know, Casey. I will make sure she's okay. You don't get it. She was there for me when no one else was. Look, Mavs, right, okay? You need to stay here and rest. You're still going through withdrawal. Look, I'm going with or without you. You're so rubbish. Marty, is Kara here? We had a call. Kara. What happened? We couldn't save her. I'm so sorry. No. Yeah. I'm sorry, honey. Is it your fault? But I should have helped her. Like she helped me with. With what? Did she help you with the baby? I don't know. I can't remember. Try, Cassie. I am trying. Can you just keep your voice down, please? What? Billy's upstairs, remember? I don't care about that little brat. My friend just died, okay? Mom! No, um, I'm coming up, Billy. Don't you come down here. Cassie. What? You don't care about me. You never cared about me. You only care about the baby. Well, guess what? The baby's gone. Mean what I think it means? No. Yeah, um, Mum has asked Billy and I to join her. It's her shout. Oh, sorry, it's her last Hang minute. On, sorry, you're, went... you're taking it off. I can't have Billy around this. Casey didn't mean that, okay? She's she's grieving. She's in withdrawal. Her baby's missing. Yeah, okay, okay, but I have to think of Billy. Yeah, but well, it won't happen again. I just talked to Casey. She, she likes Billy. Billy likes her. Which is why this is so important. What do you mean? He's invested in her, like a big sister. You're not the only one who misses Wilder. It's okay, Nick. It's a good thing. No, it's not, because they're not family. No matter how much you wish they were. So this is really about me? Your focus is Cassie right now. Yeah, it doesn't mean I want you to go. Cassie will get through this. I hope so. She will, Nick. I will make sure of it. Okay. Billy, we've got to go. Nick. Will you when I get there, okay? Oh. Okay. Have a great flight. <laughs>